In a previous video, I completed the calculation for work done by an adiabatic process by using a formula. In this video, we'll be using calculus to prove the work formula for an adiabatic process. So we have a pressure and volume graph with an adiabat on it. The adiabatic process is where there is no heat transfer and pressure, volume, and temperature all change. Below this graph, we have two pistons that represent the change in volume of this process. We want to find the work done by the piston, which will be represented by the area under the adiabat curve. Recall the ideal gas law for an adiabat process is P1 times V1 to the power of gamma equals P2 times V2 to the power of gamma. Gamma being the ratio of the specific heat of a constant pressure process divided by the specific heat of a constant volume process. This can be found by looking up the value for the gas or substance you are working with using a Google search. We'll be using air and assuming a gamma of 1.41. So if we rearrange this formula to get pressure 2 to one side, we get this equation, which represents the equation for the line on the PV graph. Really, this equation is what we're using to find the Y or pressure value at a given point on the graph. So we will change the pressure to a Y value instead. The pressure 1 times volume 1 to the power of gamma will remain constant, so let's make it easier to look at and replace all those values with a k value in the equation. Now we need to integrate. Recall that dividing to a power is the same as multiplying that value to the negative power. We will do this to our change in variable, or delta volume. Using the power rule in calculus, which basically is where you add 1 to the power, then divide by the new power value. We get this expression, plugging in our k value and our volume 1 and volume 2 into this equation, we get the previous work value of 23,565 joules of work. So it's the same equation as before, it's just not as condensed. Poll update. That concludes this video. Hope that I've earned a like, share, or subscription. It really helps out the channel if you do. If you like this video, you may like one of these videos as well. Let me know how I'm doing in the comments down below. Thank you for watching.